So I don't know if this is something you struggle with, but there's kind of two sides to this art thing. There's the intellect, right? There's when we're being thoughtful and we're thinking and we're being careful. Like if I'm making this mark and I'm wanting it to be, I'm really trying to control it. I'm thinking about how I want to make it perfect. And I go back and I go kind of slow doing this. And I'm using a painting guide here to get it so it's just as perfect as perfect can be. And sometimes our work gets like this. And this is great. This is really controlling. But I know for so many people that it also is important to be really loose and being kind of out of control. And those are opposites. And I get a question a lot. Well, how do you do both of these? How do you do this and also be loose and trying to think of all this all together at the same time is really, really challenging. Well, the answer is you can't. You can't be controlling, intellectual, precise, and emotional, spontaneous, and out of control at the same time. So you actually are using two different parts of your brain and we all have these parts, <laughs> but some of us use one more than the other. We're more comfortable in one. But I'm just gonna say right here, right now, that it, your work generally gets better when you can bring in both sides of you, depending on whatever that range is, right? It doesn't matter what it looks like, but this is an invitation maybe, or a new way to think about it, that maybe you can bring more of one of these, of, of that, the intellect part to the emotional part. So the opposite of this is being spontaneous and not thinking. I've switched over and now I can be, it's the complete opposite. And these two things together look amazing. It also feels really great. Anyway, I hope that was helpful. It's just, it's just kind of a cool way to think about it and prompt yourself to go further out on the edges of what's possible for you in both these areas. Let me know in the comments, which of these, the intellect or the intuition, which of these two sides do you spend more time in? Which ones are you more comfortable in? It's really, really interesting because it's different for everyone. On Wednesday, I've got an amazing podcast coming out with artist uh, Emilio Vialba. And this guy's incredible. He somehow, his work is so different, so original and groundbreaking, but I was so surprised when I had this conversation with him that he's just this mad student of all kinds of artists and he studies them and he reads their autobiographies. It's an amazing conversation. Click on the link below and, um, and subscribe. You guys have a great Sunday. Thanks for being here. Okay. Hey everyone, if you found this helpful, I have a whole lot more to teach, share, and inspire you with every single week. So join the Art to Life YouTube channel by clicking the subscribe button below. Okay, let's do this. Awesome.